Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to view the desktop version of a website in Edge browser for Android. So this is my Android device. So let us start. So first of all you have to open your Edge browser. So let me open mine. So here is my Edge browser. Let me tap on this to open it. You can see guys it's opened. And after that you have to uh, open the website for which you want to view the desktop version. So let me open mine. So I want to view the desktop version of this website that is duckduckgo.com. So you can see it's opened and after opening your website what you need to do you have to uh, come to this bottom menu and then tap on this three dots this button. So let me tap on this and I have this uh, menu opened. So you have to expand this menu by swiping up over here. So let me swipe up and I have this menu uh, expanded. So you have to find this uh, desktop site, uh, this option uh, in this menu. So I have option over here, a uh, desktop site. You might have at some other place. So out of finding that you have to tap on this uh, desktop site. So let me tap on this. And you can see I have this uh, desktop version of this uh, duckduckgo.com opened. And suppose guys if you want to uh, go back to mobile site then you need to tap on this three dots this button in this bottom menu. So let me tap on this and you have to swipe up in order to expand this menu and you have to find this mobile site uh, over here. So here I have this mobile site so you have to tap on this. Let me tap on this and you can see guys I have this mobile site opened. But I want to view uh, the desktop version of this duckduckgo.com. So let me tap on this three dots this button and let me uh, swipe up in order to expand this menu. And then I need to tap on this desktop site. So let me tap on this and I have this uh, desktop version of this duckduckgo.com opened. So that's it. In this way you can easily view the desktop version of a website in Edge browser for Android. So thanks for watching. If you like my videos, please support this channel by subscribing to it. Thanks. Bye-bye.